welcome to my channel. My name is Rachel Banks, and I plan to bring you beauty to beauty. Okay, guys, so happy Saturday. Um, I have been under the weather, so please excuse my um, crazy face. Um, I decided to get up this morning and go ahead and start doing my cleaning. I had told you all in one of the videos um, that I was going to buy me a wine rack for my kitchen. So I ordered me a desk or a tabletop wine rack. Um, and then I decided to order some other storage um, things for my kitchen so that I can clear my counters off. Because I'm kind of like, I don't like stuff on my counters at all for the most part. Um, I know it's some things that you have to have on the counters that like essential stuff. But I'm like one of those people that I don't like a lot of stuff on my countertops. So I went out and got me some other storage pieces that I plan to share in this video as well as the wine rack. And then I tried out a new company called Grove. I think that's what it's called. Grove. Groove. Grove. I think I have to look at the name of the box. But anyways, I had saw it on social media, of course. And I saw mixed reviews on it, but they was giving away some free items if you spent $20. I was like, okay, let me test it out. Let me see if it's worth something. So the idea behind this company is that you can uh, purchase all of your cleaning supplies um, online and they'll deliver it which I will say is pretty fast. Um, so I had ordered it on Wednesday evening and I got the product yesterday on Friday. So it came pretty fast. Um, in fact, I was kind of surprised. I had saw like some mixed reviews after I had went ahead and did the $20 purchase. I had saw some, um, and trust me when I say I did exactly $20. <laughs> um, I had saw some mixed reviews like, the shipping was off, like people didn't get their um, stuff for like weeks or never got it. So I was a little scared after I had already made the purchase with the conflicting reviews. But I got mine on Friday and I ordered it on Wednesday. So no complaints here. In fact, I was super surprised. My intention was to go out and buy a few other products to compare prices. But I have cleaning products that I have in my house already that I, you know, use on a regular. That's like my ride or die cleaning products. Um, and I'll tell you how much those products cost compared to what I ordered from this company. And we'll see if it's worth it or not. I can say that it came really fast and that's convenient, especially if you are a busy person, whether it's with work, uh, kids, both, um, neither, just busy. You know, whatever it is that, you know, you may not have the opportunity to always run out to the stores. They have made it so convenient to do a lot of online shopping. And this place is, like, dedicated to, like, cleaning supplies and whatnot. So, a little cutesy place. Um, I enjoy, like, visiting their website. This is really cutesy. Um, so, I'll share with you the products that I got from there. But to kick it off, I want to start off with the storage items that I got. My son is going to help me put them together. He's already volunteered. He's like, Mom, I want to put the, um, the shelving together. So, I'm going to show you some of the shelving, and then I'm going to film him actually putting it together. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so I went to, wait, so I went to Menards, and <laughs> let me tell you, it's a Menards, I think it's in Hodgkins, Illinois, or something like that. It is the biggest Menards that I have ever been to. It was like walking into, if you're into stuff like that, so I love, I love like going into like Menards, Home Depot, um, what's up, Lowe's, all of those sort of like, um, home centers where you can get everything from like toilets refrigerators and paint to like shelving units to like miscellaneous just some miscellaneous stuff like in Lowe's I was surprised I found a lot of artwork in there um floor rugs uh for like the kitchen for like the bathroom reasonably priced too like the Martha Stewart brands I think was in um Lowe's curtains just things like and it is it it will inspire you so I like to go in there sometimes just to get inspired and then like the one-off things that I need to get like um the goo gongs the um gorilla tape and stuff like that I like to go to like a Home Depot Lowe's uh, Menards is not like on every corner it's not as many Menards in my opinion than it is like Home Depot and um, Lowe's. Like I have more of those than around me than I do Menards. So those, you know, and Menards is like a lower price place. So I would prefer to go to Menards because you save more bucks, okay? Um, what other thing? Oh, I like to get my plants and stuff from Lowe's and Home Depot. So that's what um, initially kicked me off into really want. No, I take that back. Getting paint and stuff is what really did it. But I love going in there to like browse for plants and stuff for the summer, so... 
I love those home places. So anyways, I stopped in this Menards and I wish I could have filmed myself. They have this thing where, okay, so you get your shopping cart and then it's like multi-level. So they do have, you know, the typical elevator, but it would look dangerous because it was all glass. I don't know. It was just spooking me out. Um, but they had like this, um, it was an escalator like thing, but it wasn't really an escalator. It was like a, a ramp that went up. Kind of reminded me of like, if you ever been to like O'Hare, that ramp that you stand, almost airports have it. You get on there, you just stand still and it takes you along the way. But anyways, but it went up. So it was like a ramp going up. Um, when I got on there, I'm used to like the solid and then it like, it was kind of, you know, like you moved a little, I don't know, it was scaring me. So I was like, clinch. <laughs> I was like holding on to the cart, like scared for their life. And it was like a guy behind me. Some people were just walking up, you know, like they didn't even stop and wait. And I turned around and said, I'm so sorry, but I'm so scared. And he was like, that's fine. I completely understand. But I was locked <laughs> into place. I was holding on to my basket for their life. Scared. It was like a roller coaster uh, ride. But it was kind of crazy because as I was going up, you got to see like the bottom level of the Menards. And I was telling the social, I was like, this is the biggest Menards I have ever been in. Like it was hard to find stuff because it was so big. It was, it was stupid big. But they had a lot of stuff in there and they had a lot of stuff that was on sale. And I think they got a promotion going on now where you can get on uh, everything that you buy in there, you get 11% rebate. Um, and of course I went to areas that I shouldn't have went in. I didn't buy anything, but I saw a lot of cool items, you know, like air fryers that they had on sale. They had a coffee pot, which I probably should have just went on ahead and grabbed, but I was confused and I needed to do a little more research. It was a Hamilton, um, coffee pot where you can use it. It had the normal, um, filter feature, but then you also can use K-cups, but I did not see where you could put the K-cups. I was confused. I didn't know if it was like dump the K-cup. I don't know. It was, and I, it was kind of weird and what i'm wanting to get a k-cup coffee system so that i'm not always having to like um use filters clean out filters if it already has like the um the um mesh filter the one that you could just clean uh i just want a k-cup that i could just toss out put another one in you know and just put that cleansing k-cup in there just to clean the whole system out um that's just me. That's just one of them things that I don't want to have to deal with with uh, coffee pots having to clean it out like that all the time. So I need to look that one up because it was only $39.99. And if it could do both, like that's just amazing. I would go back and get it. It was on clearance. So I'm going to look it up and see. I'm glad I brought it up so I can remember to go and look it up. And they had like um, pots and pans on sale, knives and stuff. Like all of their kitchen utensils and appliances, small appliances were on sale. They had like the um, toaster ovens on sale. They didn't have any microwaves in there. But the air fryer that I was interested in that was the most reasonably priced was a little too small for my big family. Like I have, I would have to cook multiple batches in it in order to get it to, um, you know, enough food to feed my whole family. But let's get started with some of the storage that I found at Menards. Oh, and they have like a big storage section. Like it was ridiculous. I almost was overwhelmed. Okay, so I was about to buy stuff that I had no business buying. Um in Menards um as far as like storage um stuff was concerned stuff that you know like hanging actual shelving on the wall like it was about to get intense like my it was about to be a whole project and then I came across this so you build this shelf and I only brought one because I wanted to test it out it's supposed to hold up to what it say 50 pounds oh no 220 pounds 55 pounds per shelf um, so a total of 220 pounds because it's four shelves and I was thinking about getting this for my kitchen pantry And then if I like it, they had bigger ones that I can get for my basement um Because I'm not trying to like display it for like decor or anything just having more storage um options for you know, like canned goods, um dry goods like bags of beans, you know, just things that I don't want to fill up my kitchen cabinet space, um, and I don't want it on my countertops. So, if that makes sense. And then, like, I maybe will get, like, a, if this works out the way that I think it will work out, then I will get a second one to put, like, my toilet paper and my paper towels, because I buy in bulk. And um, I like to have it in my kitchen instead of always having to go into basement to, like, replace. So, I do put, like, um, some in my bathroom, you know, like, to grab the extras in the bathroom but then there's so much because i buy it in bulk then i could just put it 
on the storage thing. I thought this was really cute and it was only $14.49. So if it works out, that's really inexpensive because initially when I went in there and I saw like the shelving and stuff like that, that I was going to try to build into my pantry. Once you buy all of the pieces and stuff, it was about to add up. Like it was about to get expensive. And then I was thinking to myself, that's like a whole project. And I saw this. I was like, let me try this out for $14.49 and it's not for show. It's not for you know when nobody see it so i was like that's pretty inexpensive and if it works out then i can get the bigger ones that hold even um uh, bigger weight for my basement for like um tools you know just miscellaneous stuff just a nice little storage area down there and then they have it where you can like connect so if you buy multiple you can connect them together see and you can make even bigger one or you can just buy the bigger one and buy so i might i'm gonna buy the bigger one if this one works out and then like still buy more of the bigger ones and then like just connect them i thought this was pretty cute and it came in different colors and i just chose the um basic white one that i probably would have to wipe down a thousand times um but it was 14 for nine. so daryl is going to put that that's my son daryl's gonna uh put it together for me to the side so i got that from menards 14.49 oh and then i got this from menards so let me show you this before i get into anything else and this is just the three-tier um basket it's called market basket let me get it okay so this is so it's all busted up because the kids took it out the car but this is what it looks like and i thought this would be so cute to go in my kitchen because it would kind of match my kitchen scheme which is like gold copperish golds yellows um hints of red um black um and i thought this was cute and let me show you something it's pretty heavy too so as you can see, it's three tier, or you can do two tier and have like a basket on your table or something. I'm just gonna do the three tier because if you don't, if you saw my Amazon haul, not the last one, I don't think, but one of the Amazon hauls, I had ordered some baskets, and I'll show you that in a minute too. That will kind of like go with this theme. So I thought this was really cute to like put some other uh, miscellaneous items, um, so that it's not on my countertop and let me just show you what one of the baskets look like oh this is gorgeous y'all okay so my son is going to put this one together so he was going to demonstrate it all look at how look at that detailing look at that color it's so gorgeous and then it's nice and sturdy like can't even press it so cute see look at this basket so just imagine and being able to feel all of this up with like a cute stuff and then it's cute like i'm so excited about this and guys this was so inexpensive how much was it okay so this was 14.49 i think this was like 30 dollars or less it wasn't more than 30 dollars it is so cute and you get three of these ginormous i mean it's not like ginormous ginormous but it's big enough to like put stuff in and it's very cutesy and it's just going to go so well with my kitchen and i still want to i do want to get some floating shelves for in my kitchen um the table nook area so that i can put some cutesy stuff like um faux flowers and you know kitchen like stuff up there uh because my house is still a work in progress it's not fully furnished it's not fully decorated either so um you know i'm almost done with the furniture part the decorating part i'm definitely far from done but the furniture part i gotta get a couple more items but anyways i thought this was so cute let me go get you the basket real quick so you can see the um basket that i had got from amazon Okay, so this is the basket that I had got from Amazon. I forgot exactly. You have to watch that haul video to see how much these baskets cost. But this basket is so gorgeous. And they did have baskets similar to this at Menards if you just want to do a one-shop stop. Um, and it's more of the, like, brushed copper. I think that's what you call it. But it goes really well. Look at how well. So, like, this has some darker brushed copper color to it. But it just really matches really well without it being too matchy matchy if that makes sense um because you don't want it to be too too matchy matchy okay so let's get to the last storage item which is this wine rack that i got from amazon i ordered it off of amazon i haven't even opened it yet so let me open it real quick okay guys so again my kitchen is kind of like that um 
gold, copper, brushed copper, just a whole bunch of different type of like bronzy, golden colors. So this is the wine rack. I will say it's a little lighter <laughs> than I had anticipated, but still cute. And like I said, you don't want everything to be too matchy matchy, but it's very cute. And it's stackable, so it's not put together yet, but it's stackable. You put all three of the um, pieces together, and I'll show you what it will look like with the wine in it. But this is going on my countertop in my kitchen. I thought this was really cute, um, and it was very inexpensive. It was less than $20 um, on Amazon, and you can buy multiple and just keep stacking if you want to. Now, you could get the floor model, but I thought that that would be too bulky in my kitchen because I am a minimalist, and I try to keep like a lot of free area. Um, so I'm super excited about this too. So that's the last of the storage items. So let's jump right into the cleaning products that I got from Grove Company. Okay, guys, so it's actually called Grove Collaboration. Um, and I think they just like collaborate with like um different um cleaning companies to like sell the products. Okay, guys, so let's get started. So with the um, box, the $20 purchase, you get a lot of free stuff, too. So um, the first thing that I seen on top, um, and it was, like, right above all of the, like, filler that's in the box, is this, um, it's called All Purpose Cleaner Orange and Rosemary Concentrate. So you make a bigger cleanser with the concentrate, and it says how to use... Uh, twist off the top and dispense into 16 ounce grove silicone sleeve spray bottle fill bottle with water replace nozzle and shake gently so this one makes up 16 ounces of um cleanser okay so i'm just taking the filler out Ooh, it's packed with a lot of stuff okay so the next thing i have in here so this was again one of the free items the next thing i have is the 16 ounce spray bottle and this is another um free item that you get so this is the spray bottle right here and I'm going to put the prices of each product. Even though this was free, I'm still going to put the price because if I love it and I want to replace it, I would want to know how much it costs. So I'll put all of that below. And it's really cutesy. So it has like the little Grove um, collaboration um, silicone sleeve on it. And it's just a glass bottle. So it's easy to like clean. And the spray seems pretty good. And it's got the off and on nozzle. And it has the different spraying um, options on here. So that's pretty cool. Um, I kind of like this. This is cute. So I'll leave the prices for everything that I show. Um, another thing that they gave me for free with my purchase is this um, really cutesy um, basket to like put all of your cleaner products. It's just like a little, um, what do you call it? Like a um, farmer's kind of um, thing. It's got Grove collaboration on there. Um, very cute. So you can put like all of your cleaning supplies as you're walking through your house and you have all your cleaning supplies in there. I thought this was really cute because I don't use, it's like a, a, what do you call it? A caddy? Yeah. Like a farmer's um, themed caddy. And you put all of your cleaning surprises, supplies in it as you walk through the house, which is convenient because when I clean, I'm like always having to walk back and forth to get stuff. So that's partially why I'm so tired at the end of the day when I'm cleaning because I do a lot of walking when I'm cleaning because I'm like lugging everything around and leaving stuff certain places and I can just put it in here and carry it around. So they gave me this free. Um, and then the next thing in here is what I actually bought. Um, this is a glass dish soap. So the packaging of the stuff is really cute. And this is their, um, what is it? Oh, it doesn't say. But this is like a collection. You know how they have like the different collections. And this is like the pomegranate something collection. Um, oh, this is cuter than I anticipated. So it's just a, so I keep my, I keep my, um, dish soap just in the regular, I only use, um, Dawn, 
dish soap and I use the antibacterial one and I leave it on top of my kitchen countertop by my sink and it annoys me but I've never done anything about it and I get the ginormous one um and it just sits there and when you pour it out you probably pour way too much because you not you don't have any sort of like you know guide to like keep it from coming out too much but um I saw this and I was like, since I got to spend $20 in order to get the free products, I might as well go ahead and get me um, this um, this dish soap dispenser. It's so cute. Look at that. And I told you my kitchen has like reds in it and this will help incorporate a little bit of pink. Um, so very, very cutesy. Put my detergent in here. I mean, my dishwashing liquid in here. And again, I'm going to leave the price of this stuff and it's glass so that's easy to clean. I don't like plastic that much. So the next thing in the bag is this gel hand soap. So this is a pretty big size thing of gel hand soap. And it's in that um, collection. It is the pomegranate and red currant. So they have a collection. And I could have gotten the, they have like a set where you can get like the glass hand soap dispenser. And then it has like a dish where you can put your bar soap on there if you get bar soap or whatever. And then this is one of the scented um, hand cleansers that they had. So, I'm going to leave the price of this, but I love that they have it in this extra bag. So, if it did bust or anything, it's not, like, ruining all of the other stuff. But this is what the soap looks like. It's a part of that collection. And I don't think that one was free. I think I paid for that one. I paid for that one. This was free, though. This is the Myers. Um, which one is this? clean day hand soap so this is made with olive oil and olive vera. so this is another hand soap that i have um really cutesy um and this is in the scent lavender i love lavender um again i'm gonna leave the price but they gave this to me free for spending twenty dollars just testing out the company um this is a nice size soap for free i got a lot of nice ass free products um and then this this i pay for this is the method which is a target brand um so i guess they like collaborate with different stores to like sell their products and this is the naturally derived shower cleaner and the um scent yang 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 but it's um non-toxic plant-based um shower and you're supposed to spray it in there after every shower use so i thought this was really um, interesting. Um, so you just spray after, after every time you take a shower. So the last person to take the shower, I probably would just go in there and um, spray. And it says, if it might touch your bum, we want it to be really clean. <laughs> a spray per day keeps the scrubbing away. Um, effortlessly maintain the gleam on your clean towels with our daily sh shower spray. With Power Green technology, it dissolves and prevents soap scum while leaving behind a wildly fresh scent um uh, very little um uh, exertion require will we would say no exertion required but you do have to extract exchange okay but you do have to engage your trigger finger okay so i thought this was really really cute and fun and something interesting so i'm gonna test it out and see first i want to see how long it's gonna last i'm gonna leave the price of this but it's just a daily spray for the shower to keep it clean um, now, this did come free. Um, this is the Method Antibacterial Bathroom Cleaner. And this is in the scent Spearmint. And it's supposed to clean 99.9% .9 of household germ, germs, 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 germs. Um, and this is what it looks like. And this came free. So, they gave me some big stuff uh, for free. Okay. Um, this is going to be so cute. Just imagine holding around all your little cutesy stuff like this i'm gonna leave by the shower but like you know just toting around all your little cutesy stuff and then the next thing that i have now did i buy this you know what did I, one of these i think this came free the method or was it all my products that came free this is an aromatic aromatherapeutic household cleanser this is a dish soap cleanser and it's supposed to cut the grease and it is in the scent lemon verbena verbena the lemon scent um let me smell oh it 
it smells good, guys. This smells, this actually smells good. Now, I, I do love Dawn and I love the antibacteria um, scent of it. I may just put this in the kitchen just to have for my hands. Because <laughs> I like the antibacterial um, soap for my dishes. That's just me. It's my, one of my OCDs. I like to scrub my dishes and I like to have the antibacterial. I always, without fail, buy the same type of Dawn because they don't have many scents in the antibacterial. So I usually get, I think it's like apple scent or something like that. And it may come in one other scent, but the apple one I think they always have. But um, I get that one all the time. Another free item. I'm telling you all, this was like the best deal ever. Another free item that they have is this lemon verbenum, verbena, however you say it, scent, the aromatherapeutic hand lotion. So again, I might just leave both of these in my kitchen and use this for like my hands and then have the hand soap because I like the antibacterial for my dishes. And then I know I purchased this. This is the walnut and cellulose scrubber sponge. So you get two sponges in this pack and I'm gonna leave the prices of this again across the screen. But it's very cutesy and then you just put one, I don't know, I kinda like it, it's just cutesy. Um, and it was not that bad in price to be honest. Um, because what brand do I use? Uh, I don't even remember. I'll leave it across the screen and I'll leave the price of the brand that I use across the screen. Um, but for my cleaning products, I normally use Mr. Clean, um, antibacterial cleanser and the yellow one, like the neon high neon color yellow cleanser. Um, that looks radioactive. I like that one. I think it's an antibacterial one too. And then for my bathroom, I use... It's a cleanser that I use that I absolutely love, especially the gel for the toilet because it makes cleaning your toilet so effortlessly because it's so thick and it holds onto the sides and it almost just cleans the toilet without you having to scrub as much. Um, but it has bleach in it and I love using bleach-based products in my bathroom to make sure I'm clean, killing all of the bacteria. All of the bacteria. Okay, last but not least. I think I paid for this. And this sucker is a mall. Now, I don't know. Let's see. How many washes? It doesn't say. Now, I can say that it looks small because you can actually see the product. Usually when you buy those little bitty bottles of like Tide or whatever, you don't see the product because the bottle is, um, you know, you can't see through it. Um, so it may be the same amount. I have to look at the ounces and I'll leave again the price of this product. It's just the laundry detergent and this is in the scent ginger mango. Let me open it up and take a sniff. Um, my favorite scent is Tide, uh, April Fresh. And then, um, if I get game, I like the moonlight moonlight something that's the purple one. Oh, it smells so good in fact sometimes i get the game just for that scent because it smells so good especially if you get like the game drying uh sheets it smells so good i know ty cleans your clothes better but i like that scent from game um let's see oh this smells cool oh this smells so good this is the ginger mango it's gonna be just for my clothes i'm gonna have to start this is gonna be just for my clothes. This is the um, ginger mango. Oh, 10 loads. It says it on top. 10 loads. So we'll see how long it I, I, I doubt this is 10 loads unless it's just really concentrated because I'm just imagining pouring. It look like two loads to me. But I use a lot of detergent. So, And that is all that I got from Grove Collaboration. So let's get started with Daryl putting together my storage units and I'm gonna show you the wine and the rack.
guys so hopefully you really really enjoyed this video i absolutely loved everything that i got i am so 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 happy um especially with my baskets and my cleaning supplies i'm gonna look fancy while i'm cleaning and ain't nothing like that good vibe i love cleaning on saturdays it gets me in a good mood when i'm like dusting cleaning looking at all my decor because that's really what you're doing when you're cleaning you're like dusting everything looking at all the beautiful things that you added to your house and just makes you feel all warm and cozy on the inside uh, fluffing out your beautiful pillows or whatnot dusting your mirrors and or cleaning your mirrors and you know dusting your little knickknacks hopefully you all enjoyed everything too uh, make sure you go to menards and check out their storage units um if you need some storage for your home because they have some really inexpensive stuff and then um the growth collaboration i'm still on the fence on whether or not i want to order from them again i think it's very convenient um purchases i just want to i need to test it out and see how long the cleaning surprise will last that will let me know whether or not i want to keep buying this stuff but I, I love especially the free stuff that i got i'm like here for this little caddy i'm here for this um this glass spray bottle um to be honest i don't use spray bottles i just pour it in a bowl and then just wipe so this is going to make it more convenient i'm not going to be all messy and wasting cleanser and whatnot um and just wasting like as far as not using everything um so i think that's gonna be really helpful and in fact it's gonna inspire me to get more cleansing bottles i believe um y'all i think the best buy out of everything was that three-tier basket for my kitchen and the um four tier plastic racking for my pantry so i'm definitely going back to menards and getting more but anyways hopefully you enjoyed this video excuse my crusty lips uh hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you like and subscribe okay if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for we're talking about supplies decor storage things uh wine racks i'm gonna do my wine of the day in certain videos or wine of the week in certain videos so make sure you subscribe and then not only do I want you to subscribe, but I want you to like, share the videos. And then to all my existing subscribers, I appreciate your support. Thank you so very much. And I will talk to you also. Bye.